the about 1,100 kilometer railway connection between Ghana and Burkina Faso is expected to begin by the middle of next year, all things being equal. This is the timeline that both countries, as, uh, from both countries, as three successful bidders have been shortlisted for the project. It will open up trade between the two countries. Here is a report from a bidders conference held here in Accra. The vision to have railway interconnectivity between the port of Tema and the capital city of Burkina Faso, Ouagadougou, remains a key priority due to its importance in accelerating the socio-economic growth and development of Ghana and Burkina Faso. The three bidders that were engaged at the bidders conference, which includes frontline investors Telo Bidi, Muta Angel Africa and Siemens, are expected to submit their technical and financial proposals by July this year to enable the two countries continue with the process. According to Railways Development Minister John Peter Mewu, the project is on course as planned. Uh, uh, projects of this nature takes into consideration your financial capability, your technical capability, your past experience, you know, and your ability to demonstrate that you can do it. So a lot of things were taken into consideration by the expert, which are the transaction advisors, in making sure that we arrive at these three uh, competitive uh, uh, concessionaires. Yeah. Of course, these deadlines are part of the critical parts. And they are necessary for us to arrive, you know, at the date of uh, uh, commencement of construction, which is the first quarter of 2022. So it is key. It's a part of the critical parts, and we are considering very, very important. We don't want to give any room for uh, any of this. Uh, uh, shortlisted, you know, uh, concessionaires to come back on it. So, and that is why the pre-bidding conference today spelled out some of these details. And I think most of them are aware of the details that have been spelled out in the morning section, which they have to adhere strictly to. On his part, the Minister for Transport, Urban Mobility and Road Safety of Burkina Faso, Vincent Dabiju, noted that his country cannot wait to see this rail line operating. He spoke through an interpreter. Burkina is a landlord country and we are... Yeah, okay. J'allais dire que le Burkina Faso est beaucoup plus pressé que le Ghana même. Uh, we have to say that Burkina is more, more urgent for Burkina than even for Ghana. Voilà, là où je parle, le président Rochmar Kishan Kabore a déjà donné des instructions. Et chez nous, les terres ont été déjà libérées pour yeah. attendre donc le tracé du chemin de fer. Okay, and our president has already given orders for land to be uh, liberated for this project to start. Parce que c'est un grand projet qui doit booster donc l'économie du Burkina Faso et l'économie du Ghana. And it's a, a big project that would, can help develop the economy of Burkina Faso and that of Ghana too. The line stretches from Impakadan through Hohoi and Yendi to the capital of Burkina Faso, Ouagadougou.